Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. progress and welcome to my channel if you're old welcome back welcome back guys all right so today I'm going to be reacting to my old Instagram photos guys I am excited for this because to be honest with you guys I haven't really gone back to look at my Instagram photos um, the first photo I posted on my Instagram page I think was about what six seven almost eight years ago and I don't even know um, what that picture looks like so I was just like you know what I think I'm gonna do a video reacting to my old Instagram photos because I realized that I don't really have a lot of old photos on my photo album on my phone and I think I do have a bunch of old um, photos on my Instagram page uh, you know how Instagram is now Instagram is like a little iCloud you know um, social media so I am gonna be reacting to my old photos, I haven't seen these photos in, like I said, what, five, six years? Um, I know when I was in college, uh, I posted a lot on Instagram, so you guys will be seeing photos from five years ago, four years ago, seven years ago. So I am uh, like, I'm already embarrassed about the photos because I know that back then, what I thought was stylish and pretty I see right now as tacky so I'm already cringing but um, if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel yet don't forget to subscribe because you're gonna get a lot of amazing videos like this video let me know what you guys think about it in the comment section below and let's get right into the video okay so this photo let me move a little bit closer up you guys was posted in 2014 that was about six years ago guys and um wow in 2014 i was sitting in nigeria and uh oh, guys iphone 4s bro you see how tiny that phone is and to be honest with you back then the phone case that i have was the shebang okay was Shiza, okay, it was the Shiza, and I loved it a lot. It just made me feel so girly, like I like the pink and all. But um, the song out, the tongue out to be honest is a no-no for me. The hair, the wig, I, yeah, and then Paris Hilton on the shirt. That's a complete no. And then the animal prints pants. Ugh. Ugh. What is that? What is that? Let's not even let, let's not even get started with the makeup, guys. Let's not even get started with the makeup. I mean, I used to be very over the top with like wing, you know, eyeliner and stuff. So I'm guessing that's what I had here and just like just did my eyebrow, but that looks terrible, but um back then I guess it was something. But yeah, that is a no-no for me. If I wanna rig this right here right now. I'm gonna give this a one, okay? A one because um, because of the posture, right? The way I stood to take the selfie, um, I still would stand like that a little bit, but just to you know, just poke a few things out more. But yeah, the overall photo is terrible. I'm not even gonna lie. It's a no no for me. <laughs> All right, next, guys. So I was in college when I took this. This was in 2015, right? I just came into the United States not too long, you know, before I took this photo. Um, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna say this was one of my favorite outfits in college. I'm not gonna lie, this was one of my favorite outfits in college. Um, back then in January, it was still cold, it was still winter. So this was, you know, it was fancy, right? It was, it was nice, it was nice. I wouldn't, you know, combine the blue, white, pink, black, you know, but I, I, could, I could see, you know, my thought process back then. I could see where I would think this was okay. But matching the blue white and the pink black. Um, okay, now I see it. So the, 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 the hoodie has a number eight. 
on the pant on the side right here, which matches the number eight on the pants. So I guess I can see where um, that idea came from. But to be honest, I wouldn't mix and match this together. They're just complete like opposite. The colors are just it's just everywhere. Yeah, no, no. And back then, that was when like pouting used to like be a thing. That's when pouting used to be a thing. As a matter of fact, it's still a thing. I still do that. Next. All right. Okay. Uh. Yeah. No. 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 I don't know. Okay, fine. I don't have any problems with distressed jeans, but I just don't like this one for some weird reason. I don't mind the top. Shout out to my haters. Sorry that uh, I don't know. I can't remember, but it said something like "Sorry that you can't phase me" or "Your hate can't phase me" or something. But well, I guess I was sending a message back then. Um, yeah, yeah. We're back with that pound again. That. But um, I, I don't really think this photo is entirely bad. I do like the makeup just a little bit. I love the the, the red lipstick. Uh, it, it, I've not really seen the full face makeup, but the eyebrow. Wait. Oh 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 oh, oh the eyebrow is a no no. The the, the, the arch is all the way. Oh, no, is is no is a no no for me. Um, yeah, no. I don't know about this photo. I don't like the way that I'm standing. I'm standing like straight. And I'm supposed to like, you know, arch just a little bit. But I don't like the way that I'm standing this photo. So yeah, no. Next. Okay, so this one. Alright. This is one of the most tackiest outfits I've ever worn in my entire life. Tacky, guys. Tacky. So that's a crop top. And like, I, I just, I don't even know how to explain this. What is this called again? I can't. What is this called again? Oh, I can't remember the name of that thing. Overalls. Right. Got it. Overalls. So you know how overalls? They're like you know you have to like you know it's like that, right? Then I took this part out so that whatever I'm wearing would show, and so I wore like a crop top, and my whole tummy, belly, side, everything was showing. And I literally went to classes like this. Yeah, wrong choice. Wrong choice. Um, it kind of seemed like back then I had just one pose. One pose, which was obviously you guys can see like that. Yeah, it's. Mm -mm. All right. Okay. Hmm. Actually, this is not actually entirely bad. Um, high waist pants with the crop top and the jean, you know, long shirt. Not bad. But with the, the tongue out thing is a no no for me. But like, why am I bringing out my tongue? Like, for what reason? Why am I sticking out my tongue? I don't get that. I really don't get that. And I had this necklace back then that said flawless. That was cute. That was very, very cute. But yeah, I don't know. This 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 um outfit. I don't I wouldn't like if I want to break this outfit right here, would I wear this outfit today? Yes, because I love high-waisted pants. I love crop tops as well. And uh jean, you know, long-ish top. I would still wear that today. So um, this is not a bad outfit to me, to be honest. Alright, so this one. Um, yeah. So apparently I was going to the movies and I wore this to the movies, guys. I wore this. This was the outfit to the movies. How ridiculous. How freaking ridiculous. Um, I would not do the shorts. I would not even do the boots. Why am I wearing boots in the summer? It's July. Why was I trying to wear boots? In July I wouldn't do the boots I would take out the shorts and the, the picture of the, like the whole picture is just ugly it's completely ugly oh the hair the pose why 
Why was I even walking like that? Like I have something like no, that's that's this is a no-no for me. This is a complete no. I feel like I have to delete all these pictures because like duh. Alright, now next. Okay, so this was back then, this was what in 2015, still 2015. Back then, this was one of my favorite photos, I'm not even gonna lie. Before I added a lot of weight, I used to be extremely skinny, guys. Like, small, small. I used to be size 2, size 3, size 2, size 3. That small, guys. And I remember this day, I literally, I think I walked, I was walking, I walked over to my friend's job to give her something. It was like, what, 3, 4 miles walk from my house. And it wasn't that far, but it was far. Um, and I was like, yeah, I gotta take a photo, bro. But um, would I wear this out today? The current state of my body? Uh, no, because I gotta hit the gym. Whatever. But um, yes, I would definitely wear this to go to the gym or to walk on the trail. Workouts, not just to you know walk around town, but yeah, it really wasn't a bad outfit. I would, I would, I would erase the the sneakers. Um, I would throw that in the garbage, which of course I have. But yeah. All right, so this photo is actually not bad. I actually went to church. So well, this was actually one of my favorite photos back then. It's still 2015, obviously. Uh, the hair was actually one of my favorite. One of my favorite. It's actually when I realized that you know short hair, you good on me. Um, the makeup was a little bit. It was subtle, not too so crazy. Um, the hues, pumps, nude pumps are a killer. I love it. The pants, the I love it. It was it was it was definitely nice, definitely nice. And I didn't do too much. I didn't you know you know stick on my tongue. I didn't I didn't pout. I didn't move my waist like I'm trying to fall down or something. So it was really easy, nice. I like it. So yeah, this is a. Mm -mm. I don't know what I was trying to achieve with this look. I don't know what I was trying to achieve, but I don't know. I don't. I don't fancy it. I don't fancy it. The hat looks a little bit bigger than my head. Why? Why am I wearing a hat that is bigger than my head? And the ponytail just looks like I just stuck it under the the, the cap and just took a photo. Like it doesn't look like an actual ponytail. I, don't, I can't really remember if, if if I did that. I can't really remember if I stuck a fake ponytail on my on the hat and took a photo, or if you know I actually made my hair in a ponytail. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know, but yeah, yeah, I will script the whole photo out. <laughs> this is actually one of my favorite photos, guys. One of my favorite photos. I actually put this in the frame. My man loves this photo, guys. I had to like put it in the frame and give it to him as his birthday gift, I think. But he loves this photo. I do not know why. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I'm not really a fan of crochet braids anymore. The eyebrow is definitely on point. It's really arched. I like it. It looks like I'm, you know, I'm having a, a smoky eye going on here. Um, it was just a simple photo. I was in my dorm room waiting for my next class. Um, this was actually in 2016. Yes, I started having sense in my head and I was like, okay. And it started changing the way I take photos. But um, it looks like I, you know, I'm now learning how to do makeup a little bit more. So yeah, I actually like this one. I like this one. Okay, so this one. Um, really tell you the motive behind me taking this particular photo you know you know putting my face straight to the sun like I'm trying to change it to spider-man or something I don't really know but I like the fact that the top matches the shoes the sneakers uh, blue and I think dark gray and the blue and the pants kind of gives you that grayish type look so I was trying to match the shoes right so I can see why I would wear this outfit but this photo, to me in general, is just, it's not clear, it's not, it, it's not a detail well, it's just, yeah, it's just, eh, you know, yeah, no. Alright, this one, okay, so I don't really, yeah, the sneakers would definitely go, 
I like the high waisted. Like, me personally, I love high waisted pants. I still have high waisted pants. Uh, I would wear the pants. Um, I still, for some weird reason, this was taken in 2016. I still, I think I still have the top, if I'm not mistaken. But the shoes are definitely gone. Um, I can't really see my face. I can't really see the makeup I did in the photo. But the photo, I think I would go with just one instead of like having like five different poses and one like it's just too much who does that again you know it's just too much so yeah now nah. yeah this one yeah mm -mm. no the shoes would go I think the, the top and the back matching is a little bit tacky to me it's just too much going on I would rather I want uh, a blue pump to match the um, the top or the bag but the hair is just all over the place. It looks like it's nappy and I need to comb it. So yeah, no. I remember this day. Um, it was actually um, not a bad day. A lot of people liked, you know, the shoes. A lot of people liked the pants, the, the shorts. So uh, yeah, it was not a bad photo. But would I wear the, 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 um, the gladiator slippers? No. I wouldn't wear it today because I just I don't I don't think they're cute anymore. I don't think they're cute anymore. I wouldn't wear that. And um, the picture, the pose was terrible because I was just like, like what, what was I looking at up there? So it's no, no, no. But I used to like that hair a lot. I used to like that hair a lot. Okay, so this is gonna be the last photo. I don't want this video to be too long, but it's gonna be the last photo. Um. I actually like this photo a lot. I'm not gonna lie. I love the fact that the nude pumps matched the new nude bag, and I just went with simple black on black. And I love the glasses. It made me look um, nice and serious. You know what I'm saying? Even though, even though I'm such a serious person, it makes me look uh, serious and like um, like I'm about to go preach in the pulpit. I actually went to this actually on the Sunday. Um, nice. I liked it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Okay, okay, this is gonna be the last one. This is gonna be the last one for her. Okay, so no, this is a no-no for me. The boots are a no-no. The hair, the hair piece thing is a no-no. The the top is a complete no-no. The pose is a complete no-no. Like this photo needs this photo needs to be deleted. It doesn't even have to be on, on, on freaking Instagram, bro. Like it has to go. Go oh. Oh, oh, all right, one more, one more. Now, the, this one, I actually like this one. Not too much, I love the choker thing. I used to love the choker thing. I used to love the choker thing a lot. And, you know, I like the way that I was sitting like a responsible human being. There's someone that has a little bit of sense. Um, not too much, I just love it. It's just so simple and, you know, nothing crazy. I realized that after, you know, a year later, I knew how to start taking photos. That's the most important thing that you guys have to um, see from the transition, all right? I'm gonna show you guys my recent photo on Instagram so you guys can see the transition. So this is my recent photo on Instagram, right? You can see from that girl in 2014 or 2015 to this girl right now. It's a complete difference, like a complete two different people. And even from 2015 to 2016, you can clearly see the difference in me taking photos and I'm just, I'm not doing too much anymore. In 2015, I was doing a lot. I was sticking on my tongue. I was, you know, bending my body like I want to break. I was just doing a lot of stuff. In 2016, I, I changed. I was like, you know, I was subtle. I was easy. I was like, you know what? I'm fine. I don't have to put any extra work. And in 2020, I'm like, bro, is it that you like me because I'm fine or you don't? Next. You know, I was actually thinking of deleting some of my Instagram old photos, but I was like, you know what? Nah, it's actually it's actually good for my own personal like collection because I don't I don't like old photos on my phone on my own photo album. I don't because I'm like mm, I don't really want to see that. But I like the fact that it's on Instagram, so I can you know go back and just look at it or whatever. I don't really have Facebook or any other social media platform, so Instagram is like the only you know social media platform that I can be active on. So I was like, you know what? I'm not gonna delete that. I'm just gonna let it. Be there so people can you know if they want to scroll down they can scroll down and see the 14 you know 2014 progress and the 2020 progress and see the glow up bro see the glow up yeah but anyways guys
right, this is the end of this video. I don't want this video to be too long. If you guys want to go see my old photos, you guys can go on my Instagram uh, page and check out my old photos. I'm going to put my Instagram handle in the description box below so you guys can go look at my old photos and laugh at me, guys. I give you permission to laugh at me. Laugh as much as you want because I deserve it because I was tacky back then, okay? No cap. But if you haven't subscribed to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. I hope you like this video. Let me know in the comment section below if you did. And share it with your friends. And I'm going to be seeing you guys next video, guys. Thank you so much and have a nice day. Bye.